Okay, so here we are with another box of nickels. As you will notice, there are three missing. That's because our granddaughter came to visit us today. We had some pennies for her to hunt, but when she got no other pennies, she uh, saw there was nickels and she wanted to hunt some nickels with me before we got a chance to video. So this is what we found in the first three rolls of nickels. We got a 1939 Philadelphia, a 1940 Philadelphia, a 1949 Denver and a 1955 Denver. Um, yeah. We're also, of course, keeping our new bisons, new bison here, nickels. So what we'll do is we're going to go through the next seven, and we'll come back and we'll show you what we've added to the previous ones. We'll be right back. Okay, okay so we finished our next seven rolls, so ten total. And I already showed you the four we started with. We have added to that a 1940 Philadelphia, oh, 1940 Denver, a 41 Denver, a 41 Philadelphia, two 46 Philadelphias, a 48 Philadelphia, a 52 Philadelphia, two of the 55 Denvers that we'll check for the D over S. A 56 Denver, 258 Denvers, and 259 Denvers. And then we did add some more bison. We found this one bison that that was probably going to replace the ones in our book. I don't know if you, uh, you can definitely see it because I can see it in the camera, but you see how, you know, shiny that thing is. And I don't think I've found one that shiny yet, so we'll get that one added to, to our book later. So we'll get through these next 10 rolls and we will show you what we got going. Okay, so we're through the next 10 rolls and that's what we had found previously. I, I've never found this many coins in 10 rolls. So I'm just going to scan real quick and show you. We found all these coins in 10 rolls. There's 31 nickels there from 1940 to 1959. So right here we have three 1940 Philadelphias, three 1940 Denvers, a 41 Denver, a 41 Philadelphia, 46 Philadelphia, two 46 Denvers, a 47 Philadelphia, a 48 Philadelphia, 48 Denver, a 49 Philadelphia, a 51 Philadelphia, a 52 Philadelphia, two 52 Denvers, 54 Denver, a 54 Philadelphia, Another 55 Denver, we'll check for the D over S. I think we got three 56 Denvers, a 57 Denver, a 57 Philadelphia, a 58 Philadelphia, a 59 Denver, or 58 Denver, sorry, 58 Philadelphia, 58 Denver, 59 Denver, and a 59 Philadelphia. I don't know about you, but I'm out of breath. <coughs> 31 coins and 10 rolls, that's 3.1 coins per roll. That's uh, I, that's the most I've ever found in 10 rolls. I think I have boxes I haven't found that many coins in. So I think we're on somebody's collection dump because we still have 30 rolls left. And if we just get 15 per 10 rolls, that's going to be incredible. So anyway... I'm going to get these lined up up here with the rest of them and uh, we'll get through the next 10 rolls and we will show you what we found. Oh, so just finished 10 more rolls, so that makes 30. Again, that is what we previously had. That is a lot of coins. We're stacking our bisons up there. And then we just found 25 more coins here. So, quick preview. We'll go back to the beginning here. We got a 1940S, a 1940P, 1941D, a 41P, two 41Ss. I don't think I've ever found two 41Ss. I think we're on somebody's coin dump, uh, collection dump, because this is a kind of incredible. I just hope they dump some buffaloes or some war nickels here soon. 46 Philadelphia, 47 San Francisco. 247 Philadelphia's, 347 Denver's, 52 Philadelphia, 53 Philadelphia, 
254 Denvers, 255 Denvers. Check the D over S again on those. 56 Denver, 57 Denver, 358 Denvers, and a 59 Denver. So we'll get those added up here to this top line and uh, get through those next 10 rolls and we will show you what okay, we Okay, so we are 40 rolls in, so that's our next 10. Again, we're going to give you a recap of just an incredible amount of coins we're finding. And these next 10 rolls did not disappoint. Uh, I think I counted 37 this time. So let's go ahead and show you what we found. We found a 30, 1938 no met mark. Still looking for the D and the S on those. We had a 40S. Um, looks like 441 Philadelphia's, 41 Denver, a couple of 46 Denver's, a 47, 46 Philadelphia, 47 Philadelphia, 47 Denver, 48 Denver, a couple of 49 Denver's. A 51 Philadelphia, a 52 Denver, a 53 Denver, a 53 San Francisco, a 54 Philadelphia, we got 354 Denvers, a 55 Denver, we got 356 Denvers, a 56 Philadelphia, we got 257 Denvers, a 58 Denver, and 659 Denvers. So we will get uh, those lined up with those and we will see if this box can keep producing that way. And uh, we do have one more box came from the same bank and uh, I don't know, we'll see if it can produce the same way. Anyway, we'll get through this next 10 rolls and we'll be right back to you. Okay, so we are through all 50 rolls, box complete. Again, this is what we have found so far. It's a lot of coin. Um, then we have our bisons up there. We're going to add into those and not keep in count, but that's a lot of those as well in this box. And then down here, as you'll see, was our Jefferson coins. We've added 26 more in this bunch of 10, and we've added three Canadians. One of these two is actually in the last bunch, but uh, I forgot to mention that, so we have found three Canadians. We'll look to see if we'll need those. If not, we'll uh, they'll go back in the bag and back to the bank. So here we have two 1940 Philadelphias, two 41 Philadelphias, a 42 Philadelphia non-war nickel, we got two 47 Philadelphias, two 47 Denvers, a 48 Denver, a 53 Denver, a 53 Philadelphia, a 53 San Francisco, a 54 Philadelphia. We got 254 Denvers, we got three more 55 Denvers, a 57 Denver, and a 358 Denver, and three more 59 Denver. So we'll get these all added back up here to the top row, and we'll come back with a wrap up. Okay, so here we are with a wrap up. I don't know about you guys, but uh, pretty impressed with that box. I really do think it was somebody's collection dump. So we have a 38 Philadelphia, a 39 Philadelphia, 240 San Francisco's. We have eight 40 Philadelphia's. We have four 40 Denver's. We have four 41 Denver's. We have nine 41 Philadelphia's. We have two. 41 San Francisco's. We have that 42 Philadelphia that's a non war nickel up here by its lonesome. We have four, maybe five. We have five 46 Philadelphia's. We have four 46 Denver's. 47 Denver, we have six. 47 Philadelphia, we have six. We have one San Francisco from 47. 148 Philadelphia, we have 448 Denvers, we got 349 Denvers, a 49 Philadelphia, we have two 1951 Philadelphias, we got 352 Philadelphias, we got 352 Denvers, 
I have two fifty, yeah, three fifty-two Denver's, two fifty-three Denver's, two fifty-three Philadelphia's, two fifty-three San Francisco's. And then we have three 1954 Philadelphias. We have eight 1954 Denvers. We have 10 1955 Denvers. We have eight 1956 Denvers, a 56 Philadelphia, a 57 Philadelphia. It looks like we got uh, five 57 Denvers. We have 10 1958 Denver's, a 58 Philadelphia, a 59 Philadelphia, and we have 13 1959 Denver's. Again, I think that one will replace the one we have in our book. That's the best looking uh, bison nickel that I have found from 2005. We have all those to check for the uh, die crack for the speared buffalo, and we have three Canadians up here 286s and 83. And I think we have all those already for a book that we're going to put together in the future. Um, I'll check my list. And like I said, if we do have them already, they'll go back to the bank. But in total, I uh, kind of counted all the bigger piles. But in total, not counting the Canadians, we have 133 Jefferson Nichols that we pulled out of one box. Um, I haven't really been keeping track. I think I'm going to start, but uh, that is the I mean, by far the most that I've ever pulled out of one box. I mean, it's got to be like five times the most I've ever pulled out of one box. Maybe four times. I don't know. Anyway, if uh, you like the video, please hit the like button. Uh, comments are always welcome. Um, and then if you're not a subscriber, please subscribe and share. Thank you for watching, and uh, we should have another one up here in two or three days for you. Anyway, thank you very much, and have a nice day.